here's a demonstration of how IR Blaster on a mobile phone works. So that's Hello, this is Mr. Mobility. What is an IR Blaster? The word IR or the term IR is actually an abbreviation for the word infrared. Infrared technology is an old technology that has been around for quite a while, for, from as early as the late 90s, and used to be quite common on phones. But then for a while it, it went away. And in recent times it has been coming back. It's coming back this time as a tool that allows you to use your phone as a remote controller with appliances like TV, DVD players, air conditioner, fridges, light bulbs in the home, in the office, whatever. This is a black phone. I'm not a fan of black phones because they are difficult to demonstrate things with. I want to show you the infrared port at the top of the phone. This is what the phone looks like. It's at the top of the phone, but everything is black. And because the port itself is black, you might not see it, but hey, just so you can see the air port, I went ahead and took several photographs, you know, just to try to get you to see it. Eventually, I found one or two clips that show it clearly. So, enjoy. Do not say I, I didn't do anything for you. A growing number of smartphone manufacturers are putting infrared ports in their phones and they're including software to enable the function because you need both the hardware and the software to make it work. I have already done the initial setup of the infrared blaster on this phone with this TV. Here's a little demonstration of how this works. All I have to do is point the phone at the TV, press the menu button here, and the menu pops up on the screen. I press the OK button, and then it takes me into the menu, and I can scroll with the directional pads there and pretty much adjust anything I want. So this is how it works. It works good for TV. It works for other appliances. Let me see if I can show you which other appliances I can add. So this is TV, satellite box, projector, AC, DVD player, air cleaner, amplifier, uh, infrared switch, fan, humidifier, food bath, electric heater, robot cleaner, drying rack, cotton, smart toilet. I can configure this to work with any of them. Also, another thing that I want to point out is that a lot of Android phones do not come with an infrared blaster. If your phone does not come with one, you can actually add one to it. What you do is buy an infrared dongle or an infrared adapter. It looks like a flash drive and you plug it into the USB-C port, the USB-C port of your phone, and then install the compatible software, something like this, to work with it. This particular software actually supports a number of dongles like that. So you can see here, you can add this USB accessory, you can add even Bluetooth accessory, and then and all that. All you have to do if you want that kind of functionality added to your uh, Android smartphone or even your iPhone, yes, you can add the dongle, an infrared dongle to your iPhone as well to enable the functionality. Get on Amazon, get on your favorite tech gadget store and search for IR Blaster, IR Dongle, IR Adapter. Pick a model that you want, order it. Once it arrives in the instruction manual and all that, it will state what software you need to download from either the Play Store or from the manufacturer's website. You install that software on your phone and you'll be able to do exactly what I have done with this television set. Like I said, it works also for other appliances like AC, DVD player, the smart fridge, smart cleaner, etc. etc. It's a nice handy feature to have if you're watching TV, whether it's um, internet TV or regular TV. You don't want to have to drop your phone and pick up the remote controller. And if you happen to lose the remote controller that comes with your TV, you can always use the one on your smartphone too. It's a, a cool nifty feature that is nice to have. And I'm glad I have at least one phone that has an infrared blaster. It's fun stuff. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll be glad to answer them. I'll see you in my next video.